Will the Alabama haters finally get their wish and Alabama get pushed down for struggling against a subpar LSU team? Or will they remain number two and they <laughs> pull out those wet diapers and call the ambulance two weeks in a row and Alabama stays number two because everybody else struggled? Oh, and for now, we're going to have an ass pick of the week after this lead up. Stay tuned to find out. What do we have here? Seems like those Alabama haters, the ones that want to call everybody else biased, when in fact, they're the ones that's biased and not showing an unbiased opinion about things, may have had a little wrench thrown into their game plan yesterday. Uh, as Alabama was playing LSU, I said to myself, because we were struggling, uh, against a not so great LSU team this year. I've had a few decent wins, but for the most part, it's not a LSU esque type team. And then it happened. I was thinking to myself, I'm going to have to drop Alabama in my poll. But then it happened. Michigan State got housed by Purdue, who has become quite apt at not only beating Big Ten contenders, but beating them by double digits. <laughs> Something about Purdue. They could just win the games against the teams they're, they're supposed to beat. Purdue might be a national championship contender. But Michigan State lost. Oregon struggled with a subpar Washington team. Um, Cincinnati, everybody's little non-Power 5 darling, uh, had to have a fumble into the end zone by Tulsa to secure that game against a third straight subpar team. Who else? Um, Ohio State struggled with a very subpar Nebraska team, just like Alabama did. Yes, Nebraska is an old school power from back in the day, but not so much these days. Um, same thing with LSU, but LSU, you know, they're not but two years removed from a national championship, whereas Nebraska hasn't won one this century. So, you can't move Alabama down. As a matter of fact, those of you that had Alabama four or five, Jonathan Lewis, those of you that had Alabama five <laughs> or even lower, y'all going to have to move Alabama up into the, not only your top four, but you might as well go ahead and put them number two because the rest of the teams in the nation, they don't look any better than Alabama. Almost interchangeable, right? But the fact is, is that Alabama has beaten Georgia in the past many times. Alabama has won national championships in the past many times. And all these other teams have not proven anything, not only in the past, but this year. Because I know what you're going to say, oh, that was last year. That, them national championships don't pertain to this year. Well, this year is the same thing, though. They're all winning at a rate that's not even, that's not any greater than Alabama. So the Alabama haters are just going to have to wait at least until Alabama plays Arkansas or Auburn to hope that maybe Alabama trips up somewhere. Because if Alabama wins out and they only got one loss and they go in and they upset Georgia, of course they're going. If Alabama wins out in the regular season and they go in the game with Georgia and they lose a second game, I, 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 and I didn't think if Alabama lost a second game they would have a chance in hell to get in the playoff. But with the way these teams have been playing underneath Alabama, Ohio State, Oregon, Oregon still got the horrendous loss to Stanford, and Stanford just got destroyed 52 to 7 last week or yesterday. <laughs> Cincinnati struggling with the Three Stooges. <laughs> Even with two losses, Alabama will probably deserve to be in over Cincinnati or. Oregon or maybe even Ohio State. Now, Ohio State and Oklahoma, 
If Oklahoma wins out, we forgot to mention Oklahoma. If Oklahoma wins out, Oklahoma will be in. But are they going to win out? Like I said, if it comes down to a two-loss Alabama team and Cincinnati or Oregon maybe, they may end up taking Alabama as a two-loss team, be the first two-loss team in there, much to your chagrin. So yesterday was the chance that the rest of the college football world needed to push Alabama down, and they all shit the bed. And that's all I got to say about that. You guys and gals, put it in the comment section what you think about these scenarios and what you think is going to happen. Like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel. And as always, KMCA to all the other